Corrosion underpipe supports, or CUPS, form a significant portion of the billion-dollar corrosion challenge that the oil and gas industry face. Operators of oil and gas facilities are aware of the big part that CUPS play in their integrity management challenge. In this video, we will explore how GUL scanning improves CUPS inspection using a frequency-based signal processing method. Generally, guided wave inspection of pipe supports from the top can be used to inspect for CUPS. GUL Scanning's latest guided wave scanner is the QSR1. The QSR1 quantifies the minimum remaining wall thickness of the pipe both quantitatively and accurately because it uses a frequency-based signal processing method that yields thickness measurements directly. By using the QSR1's semi-automatic scanning function, we help inspectors to collect data rapidly and reliably. GUL scanning has revolutionized pipeline support inspections by going beyond conventional amplitude measurements and giving inspectors the remaining pipe wall thickness at the support, which is the information that matters the most for asset life prediction. GUL scanning using the QSR1 has been independently shown to measure wall loss accurately, which gives inspectors the highest probability of detecting corrosion under pipe supports. This is because GUL scanning's signal processing method goes beyond conventional amplitude measurements. By using advanced frequency-based analysis that directly gives quantitative, reliable, and accurate pipe wall thickness data. For example, Results from the amplitude-based analysis are sensitive to corrosion profiles. A deep but narrow profile can yield the same amplitude measurement as a shallow but wide profile. GUL scanning can be used over a wide range of corrosion profiles to deliver both quantitative and accurate pipe wall thickness measurements. Signal energy losses to paint, coating and corrosion products within the pipe can also affect amplitude data. LAM-guided wave modes can also lose signal energy to liquids inside the pipe. Furthermore, signal energy can be lost to support pads between the pipe and the support. These energy losses can significantly affect amplitude and hence potentially introduce large measurement errors. GUL scanning's frequency-based method overcomes this limitation because coatings, liquid loads and support pads have negligible effects on frequency-based results. By reducing the uncertainties of typical but conventionally challenging features such as shallow corrosion profiles or energy loss to paint, GUL scanning gives inspectors the confidence in their inspection and deliver accurate data to asset owners. When it comes to calibration and inspection settings, amplitude-based measurements such as MRUT require calibration from a corrosion-free section of the pipe. The amplitudes are also sensitive to the inspection frequency selected, which often needs to be manually selected by an experienced MRUT inspector. The inspector's choice of guided wave mode is also crucial as different types of guided wave mode will give different amplitude measurements. Hence, the measurement quality will depend on the inspector's expertise. GUL scanning helps operators to keep things simple and practical by removing the need to calibrate from a corrosion-free pipe and by automatically selecting the inspection frequency and guided wave mode. GUL scanning has developed a practical and easy-to-use guided wave scanner that help inspectors to obtain reliable data in the field. In conclusion, the QSR1 is GUL Scanning's latest guided wave scanner that uses a frequency-based signal processing method which quantifies the remaining pipe wall thickness, both accurately and reliably, with negligible effects from shallow corrosion profiles or signal energy losses to paint or coatings. So when it comes to the inspection for corrosion under pipe supports, GUL scanning helps both inspectors and asset owners to obtain the highest probability of detecting corrosion and the confidence in making asset integrity decisions. GUL. Technology you can trust.